morning. Aww. Hi, it's nice to see you guys. Oh, I hope you're well and you had a good night's sleep. We had a really good night's sleep last night and feel really rested and excited to be with you today. Piggy, what is going on down there? Here, let me help. Big feelings. I am. I'm having big feelings. <sighs> okay. Hi. I see you. <sighs> you want to tell me what's going on? How are you feeling? Take a deep breath, okay? Yeah, good job. Oh, Alicia. Yeah, Peggy? I, I just can't do it. Oh, Peggy, what can't you do? My letters. Oh, you can't do your letters? Yeah, my my teacher wants me to keep practicing my letters now that I'm home. And, and I just can't do it. Oh, Piggy. Okay, yeah, that's really frustrating. It is. When I'm at school with my classmates and my teacher tells us to do something, like we've been practicing our letters all year, I could do it when I'm at school, but it's so, 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 so different at home. Yeah, it is so different at home. It's so different. Yeah, and that feels really, really, really hard. Yeah, it's so weird. It's so hard. Uh-huh, it is. And you're trying to do the things your teacher is asking you? Mm hmm And it's just not the same? Mm hmm Look, Alicia, my letters are awful. Okay, well, hey, okay, that's okay. Let's, let's look. Oh, mm hmm Yeah, okay. Yeah, what were you trying to write, Piggy? I was trying to write my name, Piggy, P I. G G Y. But that's what came out. That doesn't look like Piggy. You're right. It doesn't. And you know, not too long ago you were writing your name really beautifully. Yeah, but I can't do it anymore. Oh, Piggy. Okay. Yeah. It's so different and so hard. Yeah. It makes me want to cry. And it makes me feel really, really tired. Mm hmm I understand. Can you hold me for a minute? Yeah, I'd love to hold you. You know, Piggy, how you're feeling right now is what a lot of kids are experiencing when they're at home. They're experiencing the same things. Yeah, you're not alone. Okay. Okay. See, I want to tell you some things, okay? And I want to tell you guys some things. This is a very strange time. It's a very strange time for kids and adults. And it's a very strange time for most of the world. We've never done this before. And it's really hard. <laughs> and you know what? Teachers have never done this before. I've never done this before. That's right. You've never done this before. 
and our parents have never done this before. This is brand new, brand new for everyone. Okay. Yeah. And so you know what? I know some things that could help us through it. You do? Mm-hmm. I do. Could you help me? I would love to help you. And can I tell you something else? Yeah. I love you. I love you. And I'm really, really, really glad that you told me what was going on today. Thanks. You're really brave. You're really brave. Thank you. Yeah. Yeah, you deserve that. Okay, so... Alicia? Mm-hmm? Can I tell you something else? You can tell me anything. Mm, mm, I'm peeing my pants. You are picky? Yeah. <laughs> it's okay. It's okay. I, I, I know how to use the potty. I don't know why I'm peeing my pants again. Yeah. Piggy, that's also really normal right now. It is? Mm-hmm. Yep. So things that you haven't done for a long time or you thought you knew how to do, you know what? Your brain and body are focused on other things, like how to make sense of what's going on and missing your friends. And you know what? That's okay that that happens. Oh. Yeah, it's okay. You're not mad? No, I'm not mad. You're not mad at all? I'm not mad at all. Ah, oh, what a relief. <laughs> okay. Yeah. So, Piggy, let's talk about some things that could help us, okay? Okay. Can we tell our friends at home, too? Mm-hmm. Yes. Yes, we're going to tell our friends at home because guess what? We're all in this together. Yeah, we are. We're all in this together. We're all in this together. Okay. Okay. So the first thing I want to tell you about that's going to bring calm to your body and to your mind is a sense, a feeling that we are all doing this together, okay? Okay. So, I want us to hold hands, and you guys can do this at home too. You can reach out for our hands, or you can hold someone else's hand, and I want you to look in each other's eyes and say, I have you, I have you, I have you, and you have me, and you have me, and you have me, and we are all a family. Oh, I love that. That rhymes. It does rhyme. Should we practice it again? Yeah, please. All right, ready? I have you. That's right, you have me. And you have me. Mm-hmm. And we are a family. Yeah, we are. Good job. That brings some calm, doesn't it? Oh, it does. Not so good. Okay, and the second thing is, do you remember earlier this week when Slothy taught us about making the cloud from the person drawing? Oh, right. There were things written in the person and things written in the clouds about things we don't have any control over anymore and things we do have control over. Yeah, that's going to be really important in bringing calm. So do you remember kind of what it looks like? Yeah, I do sort of. Okay, so I'm going to actually draw it over here. Do you want to help me, Piggy? Mm -hmm. All right. So let's use this board that you were using to make your letters, Piggy. And we will draw a person. And it's so, so, so easy to make lines and shapes in the shape of a person and in the shape of the clouds. Yeah, I bet I could even do it. Yeah, I bet you could. Okay, I'm going to try. Good, I like that attitude. Okay, come on, Piggy, let's do it. <laughs> Piggy did well. Look at that. Look at that person. Piggy, that's great. Okay. And now you want some clouds? Mm-hmm. Mm, pink. I, I just was kind of thinking pink clouds would be really cool. Okay. Okay, ready? Yep. 
You sure did. And so, Piggy, anytime we want, today, tomorrow, every day if we need to, until that sense of calm, which is kind of like your heart being tucked into a blanket, anytime we need a sense of calm, we can write the things inside the person that we still have control over. Like what we eat. Mm-hmm. And like art that we make. Yes. And like running outside or skipping or jumping. Yes, exactly. Exactly. And then on the clouds, we can put things that we don't have control over anymore that we need to just <sighs> let go. Oh, yeah, like not going to school and not seeing my friends. Yeah, exactly. Okay. I think that'll help. Yeah, I do too. Even just talking about it with you helps. Oh, sweetie, I'm glad. I'm glad. I'm so glad. Ah, I'm actually starting to feel better. You are? Yeah, like like my heart's being tucked in, in in a blanket and a really cozy nap or like I'm floating in a swimming pool on a warm day. Yeah, you know what that's called, Piggy? What? Calm. Oh, I like calm. Mm hmm me too. It feels good to your body, doesn't it? Yeah, it sure does. So there's one last thing that will really help your body calm. Okay. Are you ready? Yeah, I am. Are you ready? Do you want to know what it is? <laughs> Do you want them to learn with you? Yeah, I like when they learn with me because they're my friends. Yeah, they are. They're my friends too. We're so lucky to have them, aren't we? Yeah, we are. Okay, so the third thing, let's see. Um, Evie actually made something today, and it really inspired this thought. Okay. Okay, so when I want to remember something, sometimes I tie a string around my finger, or I tie a string around my wrist. Can I tie a string on your wrist? Uh-huh. And like a little bracelet, whatever color you want, whatever yarn you have, you can tie a little string. Oh, okay, that's pretty blue. Mm-hmm. And you know what this is going to help us remember? What? All the things that you know how to do. Oh. All the things that you're really good at. Yeah, like, mm, like playing games with Slothy? Yeah! You're really good at playing games with Slothy. Uh-huh. And I like coloring with wonder. Yeah, you like coloring with wonder. And this bracelet can help remind you that I'm really good at singing. Oh, you are good at singing. And I can get myself dressed. Yeah, you can. I can even get myself a glass of water when I need one. <gasps> Piggy, you can do so many things. I can. Yeah. And when you don't know how to do something or you need support, you can ask for help. You can do a lot of things. Yeah. So this is to help remind you that you can do all those things. And then Evie actually made something today. I want to show you another example of something you could make. Okay. For yourself, you could put beads on a bracelet. And every time you're having trouble doing something, like remembering to go to the bathroom, uh -huh. you can look at each one of those beads and go around the bracelet, starting with one end, and say, I can do it. And think about that thing and go all the way around the bracelet. So for each bead, you say, I can do it. That's right. I can do it. I can do it. I can do it. I can go to the bathroom. I can do it. I can make my letters. I can do it. 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 You can do it. You can. Alicia? Mm-hmm. I'm feeling calmer in my body now. Can I try to make my letters again? Sure, Piggy. Wow, what perseverance. Piggy kind of reminds me of you guys like that. So much perseverance and tenacity. That means, you know what, even when things are hard, you still try. You try just as hard. And it makes me feel really proud of you. And it makes me feel really proud of Piggy, too. Thanks. You're welcome. Oh, okay, I think Piggy's ready. To try her letters again? I'm ready. Okay, Piggy. So, okay, let's see. P. She has an I. Uh huh. This is really exciting. I'm trying to 
Have a great day and remember we'll always here for you.